And welcome to another episode of Art Attack uh, with your host, Justin Bula, Lizzie Dastin. Aren't you so glad we don't sound like those guys? <laughs> Why don't we get into what are some of your favorite controversial paintings and why are they controversial? I think that teaching the controversial stuff is even more valuable than teaching work that everybody agrees on because the work itself seems to be like a Rorschach test. And it's not so much about the object or the painting or the photograph, it's about the adult reaction to that. I lived through Piss Christ. I was in the urine that Christ was in. <laughs> But what happened was, I just remember seeing it and, and thinking about what, where, like I said, as much as I hated Jesse Helms, where has the art movement gone to where we have to celebrate or even talk about this photograph of a figurine being put in urine? Was he even a great photographer? Absolutely. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. He's a great photographer, but it transcended that. The fact that it was in your art school and the fact that you had this conversation and hopefully that conversation led to what is permissible in art. What is art? What is spirituality? Is this a false idol? To me, the issue is more about the cheapened art object mm. than it is about the urine. I see it as totally gimmicky. I get it, but it's I think- sticky. It's like, here's a shtick. Oh shit, that worked. Now I'm gonna do, what can I do to top it? I'm gonna come, in a, I'm gonna come on a thing and do really cool photographs. So that's, you don't think that much. Rembrandt, once he did his portrait, that that became a shtick? Aren't artists, they have a did work- Did you just that, compare I did, because you always Price bring up Rembrandt. Rembrandt. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, everybody, thanks for joining us and tune in next time when we talk about basically the same stuff.